Ever since I was small, I've loved special effects in movies. I loved the Indiana Jones films, and Star Wars, and James Bond. But what I loved even more was watching how they made the special effects in the behind the scenes documentaries. There are quite a few special effects in my little YouTube videos. Here are 10 and how I made them. Number 1. The first special effect I ever tried was this one in the first Tuck Shop video. This is very simple. I just stood up and moved the chair. Afterwards, I cut the middle part out and added a sound. This is an example of cutting. Number 2. This is from the Halloween game. This is also a very simple effect. First, I had to blow a good bubble and have it burst nicely. Uh, this took 12 takes. When I had a good bubble, I just added a balloon pop to make the burst sound bigger and better. This is an example of using a sound effect. Number 3. The sound was important for another part of the Halloween video. This jump scare. Without the music, or with different music, it really isn't very scary but with the music, it makes you jump. This is an example of using a music cue. Number four. For my Christmas in Hong Kong guitar solo, I wanted to make a joke with two Mr. O's. I recorded each guitar part separately, pretending to look at the other Mr. O each time. Then, I simply put the two shots together this is an example of split screen. Number 5. I also used split screen to create the four Mr. O's on a sofa in the elephant video. Again, I recorded the first three, pretending to look at the new Mr. O's, and then split the screen. For the last Mr. O, I lay on this big green sheet and removed it in the computer afterwards. This is an example of green screen. Number 6. Green screen was also used to do Jedi Jenga. First, I recorded myself pretending to move the block with the force. Then, I filmed the block against a green piece of card. I attached the block to a chopstick and more green paper, then removed the green in the computer. Then, I changed the colours to make it look nicer. This is an example of colour grading. Number 7. One of my favourite special effects is this one. Do you know what it is? It's the moon. The problem was, the lyrics go, High above Kowloon, I see the autumn moon. But when I was on the Star Ferry, the moon was not above Kowloon. It was above Hong Kong. So, I took a photo of the moon and added it to the shot. Simple, but effective. This is an example of compositing. Number 8. This is similar to how I made my lightsaber in Tuck Shop 3. First, 
I used a metal pole for filming. Then I painted over the pole frame by frame on my computer. This took a long time. There are 24 frames in one second. So this little shot has 133 pictures to create. Each picture took about one minute, which means it took about two hours to create just a few seconds of the video. This is actually quite similar to how the lightsabers were made in the real Star Wars movies. This is an example of rotoscoping. Number nine, getting attacked by the rice cooker was a fun effect. To make the plug jump up at the camera, I just dropped it and then reversed the video. This is an example of reverse motion. Finally, the glove from the tree. This effect was done with editing and sound. There are three shots. In the first one, on the bench, the glove doesn't really go into a tree, it just falls on the floor. The second shot shows the glove in the tree. This tree was actually quite far away from the playground. Finally, the third shot was just me getting hit with the glove again and again. This is an example of the many different types of editing. You can see these special effects in many big Hollywood films. Cutting. Sound effects. Music cues. Split screen. green screen, color grading, compositing, rotoscoping, reverse motion, and, more generally, editing. I'm a teacher, and I just do these special effects for fun. But they are all real jobs. If you are interested in this kind of job when you're older, you might like to think about STEAM, science, technology, engineering, art, and maths. A special effects artist would be a technology and art job. And remember, this is a job for girls as well as boys. If you want to do this, you can. <laughs>